Hey guys, Barbie here. So I am with Diamond Ladies in Team Empire. Hello. Hello. Carmen, Hi. Melgosa, Denise Rodriguez, Jasmine Ornelas, and Karina Ornelas. So we got together to celebrate uh, Karina becoming a, a Diamond Coach. And we just set some goals. And each of these four ladies has as their goal to... Quit our jobs. jobs fire their boss. So I asked them to project themselves into the future and um, to write down 20 answers to the question or to the sentence, I didn't achieve my goal. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I failed to achieve my goal because I didn't. So if you can start with that phrase and then watch this. I failed to achieve my goals because I didn't lose the weight. I failed to achieve my goals because I was lazy. I failed to achieve my goal because I didn't get organized. I failed to achieve my goals because I came too distracted. Because I became, I didn't become a product of a product. Because I caused or created excuses. Because I didn't follow the game plan. I was very disorganized. I didn't believe I could succeed. I lost track of my spirit. I didn't commit to my exposures. I never asked for support to my coach. I let others' impressions of me shape me. I didn't write everything down. I didn't help my coaches get to Diamond. Lack of passion for beach body. I didn't follow the game plan. I didn't use high rise effectively. I didn't believe in myself. I got involved in too many projects. I didn't stay accountable with my team. I didn't love myself enough to work out. I didn't read for personal development. I never follow up with customers or coaches. I wasn't there for my coaches. I ate badly. I didn't schedule my daily activities. I stopped blogging and podcasting and creating videos. I didn't help my customers reach their goals. I didn't read. I didn't recruit more coaches. I didn't care for personal development. I didn't do any self-development. I didn't follow the game plan. Um, I didn't commit to my fitness. I stopped writing the things that I was doing. I didn't post on the empire. I didn't absorb all the tools. I didn't encourage my coaches. I was not clear on my obje objectives. I didn't get out of my comfort zone. I didn't make appointments. I didn't commit to each body. And I didn't follow up the game plan. Awesome. So I don't know about for you guys, but this is super emotional for me to hear the traces of your, of your failure. You know, um, there are specific reasons why you succeed or you fail. Um, if you do all the things that you mentioned right there, you won't be able to, you know, quit your day job and, and fire your boss. So, you know, it's better that we project ourselves into the future now. Um, because we don't want to be sitting here a year from now or 11 months from now and not have to achieve this, you know? So let's, um, what do you need to do? So what is the beginning of the sentence? Of I achieved this because... I so, oh, go ahead. Sorry. I achieved this goal because I believed in myself. I achieved this goal because I worked the game plan. I achieved this goal because I built relationships with my coaches. I achieved this goal because I came more organized. Because I stayed accountable to myself on the empire. I achieved my, this goal because I executed my daily activity list. Because I stuck to the game plan. I started using high rise more effectively. I lost the weight and had rock and before and after pictures. I talked to every one of my coaches. I did at least two exposures a day. Became a real leader to my team. I followed the game plan. I made time for check-in emails. I scheduled my life's activities. I work more productive when I say I will. I was a cheerleader to my customers. I put myself first. I got out of my comfort zone. I work consistently on my blog, posts, YouTube videos. I talked to my coaches weekly. I believed in my strength. I worked on personal development. I learned how to balance work and life. I stayed committed to my body. I love myself enough to make my meals. I organized my workspace. 
I focus and I, I learn not to be distracted by other stuff. I built relationships with the people around me. Be become a product of a product. I followed up after my exposures. I organized a week weekly meetings with my coaches. I learned from the leaders in our group. Absorb from the leaders of my group as well. I committed to making my goal a priority every day. I follow my schedule 100%. I read, learned, and implemented from the books that I read. I spoke to my success partners. I continue having fit challenges. I stop doing too many to-do lists and focus on only one. I talk to new people every day. I make customer service a uh, priority. I held home parties. I start sending weekly emails to my customers. I was a walking beach body billboard. I drank Shakeology every day. I believed in myself. I was a product of the product. I love it. I love it. How do you feel? Just affirming the things that you need to do. Like it's going to happen. Like I'm ready to go home and accomplish it. Yay! <laughs> it, so. is, it is going to happen. Yeah. It's actually happening right now. It's Not happening. Like you already know the things that you need to do, so you're kind of working. And you know already what to, like, to do first. It's like my creator map. That's right. Come to Barbie's house and you create a map. Or <laughs> right? Um, yeah, don't you feel like, I mean, that's the point. We just created a map for what you need to do. And so, you know, when people say, like, I don't know what to do, you know, to be successful, like, you know exactly, you just said it. I mean, you each made a list of the 20 things. And, you know, before we made this video, we did go around the room and, you know, around the table and everyone started repeating themselves. And that's because, you know, success is not an accident. You're not, you know, making stuff up. It's the same activities that are going to make you successful. So, and the same activities, you know, that are going to make you unsuccessful. So, um, you're going to be a full-time beach body coach by when? Because we have to set a deadline. And then realistically in a year, from a year for today. So what's the exact date? Um, what's the date? <laughs> um, let's say by August 31st. August 31st, 2012. For me, it's August 1st, 2012. For me, it was April. April 2012? August 31st, 2012. All right. So you've got it, you're, you, you're on video, so it's, <laughs> it's real, you're diamond coaches now, and so by next year, you'll be full-time Beachbody coaches. Yay. Yay! Bring it, make it happen.